The moment I met Courtney, the first thing I noticed about her was that she made me laugh. She adds lightness and joy and a sense of happiness to my life that I would be so lost without. Fast forward to a few years ago, the night we met Andrew, the first thing I noticed about him was that he made Courtney laugh. So for me, the first box was checked. A week after we met Andrew, I got this text from Courtney that said, Kels, oh my God, he said he wants to wine me and dine me. So for me, the second box was checked. And as for the third box, it was less about Andrew being so great and more just the fact that he's over six feet tall. I don't know if you've noticed. Andrew, I will never, ever forget the first time you made me laugh. Oh my God. I was leaning against the steering wheel, Beautiful. laughing so hard that I couldn't breathe. In that moment, I knew I wanted to be with you. I'm sorry if it's off to my Today, on our wedding day, there is no doubt in my mind that choosing you was and continues to be the best decision of my life. You are my best friend, my soulmate, and the man of my dreams. I know the rest of our lives together will be full of happiness. I love you, my husband, with all my heart, forever. Courtney. Courtney, we've dreamt about the beautiful place you would get married, the gorgeous dress you would wear, but most of all, we've dreamt about that man sitting next to you. We never could have anticipated the way he would love you, the way he would fill a part of your heart and soul you didn't know was missing, and the way he would fully embrace your very bizarre sense of humor. We never could have dreamt up Andrew. Courtney, I take you to be my wife. Andrew, I take you to be my husband. I promise to be true to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and honor you all the days of my life. All the days of my life. Court, you're a beautiful, bright, strong woman and will always be the most special daughter you could have ever imagined. Keith Susan, you raised a fine young man who I am proud to finally officially call my son-in-law. Andrew, you're funny, kind, smart, and a perfect compliment and balance to Courtney. Congratulations. I remember the exact day I met Andrew. It was April 12th, 1989. And I remember the first day I met Courtney, too. For her to make it through her first NISO gathering, with all our neurotic tendencies on full display that day, we knew she definitely was a keeper. And Andrew, I've grown to love you, too. To the newest Mr. and Mrs. Itzer, cheers and mazel tov.